YouTube channel. Hello if you're new here, hi my name is Katie and welcome to my channel. But as you can probably tell by the title of today's video, it's basically going to be a very kind of different video from me today. Now I've never done one of these kind of videos before, but I have kind of seen them floating around and you know what, it actually quite intrigues me. So I mean if you aren't new here and you have been watching my channel for a while, then you will basically know that Christmas is literally my absolute favourite time of the year. I absolutely love it to death and I thought, you know what, the Christmas scratch cards are now out and about in the UK so I mean I thought, you know what, I'm going to dive in, pick a few different ones out and yeah, just see if they're lucky and see if my luck's any good really. I mean I literally have no idea how this is going to turn out and I just think these are kind of really kind of like fun videos, kind of like a little bit of a kind of like a social experiment to kind of see how kind of lucky you can actually get with these kind of scratch cards depending on kind of like how much you spend. So I have actually spent over £100 on these, which is absolutely crazy. Like thinking about it in my head, I'm like, wow, you have really just spent over £100 on scratch cards. But I mean, hopefully it's going to be very, very lucky and we are going to win. But yeah, let's dive right in and see what actually kind of happens really. So I did actually pick up a few different ones, like I said. Now I actually picked up these ones, which are Christmas advent calendar. Now these actually are £5 each and I picked up, I did actually pick up a couple from like different shops. So I got two of these from one shop and I did actually grab a few more of these. I've got six of them in total. So here is another four. So they are basically one of the ones that we picked out. I then also got these ones here, which actually look quite lucky. These ones here are called Merry Millions. And these are also a five each, just in case any of you are kind of wondering like what kind of ones I'm te like testing out as such. And I did actually get six of them ones as well. And then the other kind of ones that I got were some called Christmas Cash. Now these are actually two pounds each. And to be honest with you, I literally have no idea how many I got of them. I literally just made it up so that it kind of was a few, was like a few money, if that kind of made sense. And then the next ones that I actually picked out are these one pound ones. Now I did actually pick up quite a few of these just because I mean, I don't know, they just seem like they could be lucky because they're only a pound. So I mean, I did actually pick up quite a few of them as you can see, just because I mean, like I said, it's best to just have a few a variety. And then the last ones that I actually picked up were these three pound ones and they just kind of look like this, these are winter wonderland ones in case any of you were kind of wondering. So yeah, they are basically all the scratch cards that I picked up. And then I did actually, oh, I did actually get this 50p back. Now I'm saying that this is my lucky 50p to scratch them off. It's basically got a picture of a bear. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure if it's meant to be Paddington Bear or not, but it's um, got a picture of a bear and a London, oh, it's St Paul's Cathedral, I think it's meant to be, in the background. So I mean, this is the lucky 50p that I'm going to be scratching all of these scratch cards off with. So yeah, without me kind of like rambling on anymore, let's get scratching guys. And yeah, hopefully these are gonna be lucky. But before I quickly scratch them off, I do just quickly obviously wanna say that this is literally a one-off video that I'm gonna be doing. I literally love Christmas and yeah, I just thought this was quite a fun like video idea. And I mean, like I said, I have seen a few other YouTubers do videos like this and I actually really enjoy watching them. So I just thought I'm just gonna make one for myself, if that kind of makes sense. I just want to like be totally clear though and say that I'm not like advising anyone to kind of like go out and spend over a hundred pounds on scratch cards because I mean there's probably a lot kind of other things there's definitely a lot of other things you can buy over a hundred pounds and I mean the scratch cards definitely aren't a kind of way to kind of like make money or anything like that this is literally just a video for fun which I've decided to do so yeah I just wanted to like clear that up before I kind of scratch any of these off but anyway let's get right into it because I'm so excited to see how this turns out really so yeah, let's dive right in. Which one should we start with more to the point? I have so many here. I literally feel like, I don't know, there's literally just so many here that I don't know where to start. So the first one that I'm actually thinking of starting with is these ones. Now these ones are actually Christmas advent calendar. And what did it say you can do? So there's six prizes of a quarter of a million pounds, which is crazy because I mean, I'm not entirely sure how this is gonna go. So it's in each game, match two symbols to win a prize or a match two double symbols to win a double the prize. So right. Let's get scratching guys and hopefully this is lucky. So on the first one that we've actually scratched off, we've already won a fiver. So literally we've matched two candles and I mean it literally says do like one right the way through to, is it 20 or 25? I can't remember what it says on it. But literally I've only scratched two off, I don't really know if you can see, I've done like number one and number two. And it's on the number two that we've won a fiver already, so I mean let's see how this continues. But that's pretty good off straight away, considering these are five pounds, I mean I've literally got my money back on the first one. So 
the first one I did actually win a fiver on, but yeah, that is obviously quite lucky to be the first one I've already kind of got a fiver back. I mean, hopefully that kind of continues, but yeah, let's just see how this one goes. So I have actually teared that one off just because I mean, I might as well make a kind of like winning pile and a pile that wasn't so lucky really, but yeah, that's obviously in the winning pile already, but let's carry on with the next one. Let's carry on with these ones because these ones seem quite lucky and let's scratch them off and see how they go. So that one wasn't actually as lucky, but I mean, let's move on to the next one. I don't really know which one to try next, you know. I don't know if to try these ones. I'm thinking of maybe scratching a couple of these ones off next, which are the Christmas cash ones. Now these are actually two pounds, and this is a top prize of up to a hundred thousand pounds. So I mean, yeah, I don't really know why I said it in that voice to be honest with you, because I mean, I don't really know how this is gonna go. But it says, find any of the winning numbers in any row to win prize. Find a times two to win double the prize for that row. Okay, right, I think that kind of makes sense. Right, let's scratch off the winning numbers. Right, we've got 15, 14, and 13. Oh, literally, one right before the other. Right, let's scratch this off and see how this goes in. And that one wasn't very lucky at all. Let's have a look at this top one to see if this one's any luckier. Right, neither of them um, Christmas cash ones were lucky. So I feel like maybe we should pull another two off of this thing and see how kind of lucky these ones are because I mean I don't know I've got quite a few of these ones so hopefully at least one of them is lucky but I mean it just kind of shows like how many you need to buy before there's kind of like one that kind of wins if that makes sense because these are literally all on a row so I mean yeah let's scratch these ones off and see if we are any luckier on these ones now the next Christmas cash ones again weren't very lucky so I mean I feel like maybe I should do the next two just because I feel like, I don't know. So far we've had four that are like continuously after each other and none of them have been a lucky so far. I don't really know if it says on the back of here how many you're gonna buy before there's like a lucky one as such. I mean, maybe it doesn't say. It does actually say on the back of these Christmas cash ones that the overall odds of winning a prize are approximately one in 4.15. So I mean, we've scratched four off that are all in a row and I mean, they aren't very lucky. So hopefully, these are the lucky ones because I mean, otherwise, these ones weren't the luckiest to be honest with you. I mean, yeah, let's continue to scratch and see if any of these ones are luckier. So the next two that we actually scratched off again weren't very lucky. So I mean, that is now six of them ones that we have actually scratched and we haven't kind of won anything. I mean, this one is definitely the luckiest one so far, which is the Christmas advent calendar one. But I mean, I feel like we might as well continue to scratch these Christmas cash ones, just because I feel like the, we've only got four left now. So I mean, I feel like we should probably break them in half again and scratch another two and just see how this goes really. Just because I mean, I don't know, hopefully one of these wins, <laughs> otherwise that's like 10 of these that weren't lucky. And if the odds are like one in four or one in 4.15, I think it says, then hopefully, um, You'd, you'd expect like maybe two to win, wouldn't you? But I mean, we would just have to wait and see really. So yeah, let's scratch these off and see how it goes. So we have actually won a fiver on this one, which is obviously two pounds. So I mean, we've over doubled our money on this one, but I mean, where it says one in four, we have actually literally scratched off six and this was the seventh one on the row. So I mean, I don't really know if I believe the odds. Maybe it's kind of like not one in every four, it's like maybe slightly higher, unless this, any of these last ones are like winners as well. But yeah, this was actually the seventh one that we scratched. But I mean, at least we won, we won a fiver. So I mean, that can go in the winning pile. So now we're up to 10 pounds that we've got back so far, which I mean, pretty good guy if I'm honest with you. I mean, it could have been a lot worse at this point. We could have literally won absolutely nothing. But I mean, we were 10 up. I mean, yeah, that's pretty good going, isn't it guys? But let's scratch these last winning numbers off and see what it's saying. So on this one, we have actually won two pounds as well. So, I mean, let's add that to the winning pile. So we're now up to 12 pounds, yeah, 12 pounds in total. And we've still got two more of the Christmas um, cash ones to scratch off. So, I mean, so far we've scratched, is it eight? Yeah, we've scratched eight. And I mean, yeah, we've scratched eight and two of them have won. So, I mean, that does now work out that their odds on the back are right of one in four, one in every four kind of being a winner. So yeah, that absolutely adds out kind of thing, but we've still got two more to scratch. So I mean, let's see how these ones turn out. So on the final 
my two Christmas cash ones that I have actually scratched off. I mean, we didn't actually win anything else, but I mean, at least we've won on two of them. So two out of 10, we actually won on. So I mean, it does say one in every four, maybe the next one after that was actually probably a winner or something like that. I'm not entirely sure. But yeah, so far we have at 12 pounds back, which I mean, whoop whoop <laughs> and i mean the story of the lighting keeps changing up behind you i have actually got a ring light on i'm sat in my kitchen but i mean the sun has just gone in like behind the clouds it looks it's gone really great if i'm honest with you it looks like it's gonna rain so sorry if the lighting it keeps going a little bit funny but yeah, i basically just thought i'd let you know the latest on the weather in case you are wondering what is going on in the background but yeah i feel like maybe we should scratch some of these pound ones off next just because i feel like i don't know hopefully they're gonna be lucky so on these pound ones they are basically just say merry christmas on he says the top price is a hundred thousand pounds on each of them now i do actually get 12 of these so i mean hopefully we'll see how it says let's see what it says on the back about the overall winnings on the back of this one it says the overall winnings are approximately one in 4.58 so i mean it's slightly harder to win on these ones than the christmas cash ones apparently but i mean yes it's basically one in every four and a half kind of win so i mean hopefully because we have 12 you'd maybe hope that maybe two of them again might win i mean we're just gonna have to scratch and see aren't we but yeah let's see what you have to do on this one. Oh, you just have to match three to win and you get a bonus game of if you find a present then you can win as well so let's see how this goes guys so out of all of these six that we've scratched off so far we have actually won a fiver which, I mean, it's pretty good considering they're like a pound each. I mean, if you just bought that one, then, I mean, it'd be four quid up. But, I mean, obviously, we've bought, like, quite a few of these. So, we're not quite, um, like, five pound up as such. But, I mean, we have one of five on one of them. So, I mean, at least that is pretty good. So, I mean, I suppose I should probably break this off and put it into the winning pile. Oh, so that's in there. Right, that's the losing one. And then, yeah, this is the winning one right here. So, this is actually the winning one. So, that can go into that pile and then they can go into the unfortunate part. so with that extra five added we are actually up to 17 pounds so far which i mean it could be a lot worse like i said i'm actually quite happy that i've got 17 pounds back but i mean let's see if we can add anything else extra to this but i mean 17 pounds is pretty good at the moment i feel like i mean let me know what you think is that pretty good after all of this I'm not, i don't know maybe i'm just being a bit like gullible and being a bit too excited over the 17 pound but i kind of feel like it could have gone a lot worse so i mean i'm happy with that at the moment but i mean yeah let's continue scratching these one pound ones off so i actually have six more of these left to scratch i mean yeah let's get scratching these ones and let's see how it actually finishes out turning out really six last ones that we did actually scratch we did actually end up winning another pound so that actually takes it up to 18 pound in total that we have got back so that one can go in the winning is that the right one yeah that's the right one so that actually takes the total up to 18 pound which i mean it's getting better isn't it guys but yeah, i feel like maybe we should i don't know try these ones next which are actually the Merry Million ones. Now, it says there's four prizes of one million pound on these. So, I mean, I don't really know how lucky these ones are going to be. It says your overall odds of winning are one in 3.49. So, these are kind of like the best ones so far out of the kind of like odd wise on the back. I mean, I'm not entirely sure what those Christmas advent ones that I first scratched off were, but when I scratched the rest of the other ones that I got, I will tell you the odds on the back of them ones. But yeah, it says that there's 14 chances to win on these. So I mean, hopefully they are going to be lucky. Now, yes, yeah, so I'll scratch these two off first. Now, what do you have to do, more to the point? Find a number five to win a five, or find a number 10 to win a 10, or find 20. Oh, these are the bonus games first. Yeah, let's just scratch and see how this turns out, guys. I mean, I literally have no idea what I'm doing. I've never scratched any of these Christmas ones before. But, I mean, yeah, we're doing all right so far. We've got 18 pounds, haven't we? But, yeah, let's carry on scratching and see how these turn out. So, we've literally just scratched the bonus games off of this one. And we have actually won a fiver from these. So, I mean, let's continue to scratch this side off and see if we've won anything else. What else do you need to do? Match three symbols match three identical symbols in a row to win the prize sounds pretty simple let's crack on with it so on that first one that we did actually scratch we did win a fiver and that is how much it actually cost to get it so i mean what was this 18 add five is 23 if my maths is right i mean if my maths is wrong i'd pull it like what the right amount is on the screen but i'm sure that that is literally the right amount there so 23 quid that's not bad and we've still got more to scratch off so let's see how these go 
one and that one we didn't actually win so yeah we're still up to 23 pounds now i don't know whether to do a couple of these christmas advent calendar ones yet that i did at the beginning or whether to scratch a few of these winter wonderland ones or i feel like i might try a few of these christmas advent calendar ones again just because i mean i feel like i don't know maybe if i do two now and save two for later then I mean, hopefully we will see how this goes really. So yeah, let's see if these ones were as lucky as the first one. Now, this one wasn't actually very lucky at all, but like I said at the beginning, I said I'd let you know what the thing was on the back to night. Now this is the overall odds of winning are approximately one in 3.22. So these are actually meant to be the luckiest ones out there. So yeah, let's scratch the other one of these off and let's see if this one is any luckier. That's when I first started scratching these ones, I literally scratched them in order. So like I did one, two, three, four. And now I'm just like, do I really need to scratch them in order or is that just literally just gonna take extra time to do? I feel like if you was just like really like wanting to long this game out you could because literally you can just scratch him in numbers but i mean i don't know it just depends how you really want to scratch him off doesn't it really so yeah i'm literally just scratching them off to hopefully see if this one's gonna win if we just won yeah we have we just won a tenner here so i mean that is pretty lucky on that one already so yeah we're already a tenner off on this one let's see if we can actually win £10 on that one so I mean that has brought our total up to £33 if I'm doing one that's right but yeah that's pretty good going isn't it guys or I mean I'm not entirely sure let me know what you think but yeah £33 so far with that one so yeah I definitely say they're the lucky ones we've won on two of them so far and we've still got two or more of them to scratch off now I don't really know whether to do these ones I feel like I want to save them ones till the end just because I feel like they might be lucky but I feel like maybe if we could scratch a few more of these ones off and see how these ones go which are the merry million ones so yeah these are the ones that say that there's 14 chances to win so hopefully they are pretty lucky so on that one that we actually scratched off we did actually win another five up so that brings our total up to 38 pounds now i think so yeah that is actually the one that i just scratched off and i've obviously just won again so that can go into the winning pile now i feel like maybe i should try these ones next which are the win top ones allowed ones it says that there's eight top prizes of 200,000 pounds and it says see reverse for play instructions second edition okay so these ones in case any of you are wondering again on the overall odds of winning it does actually say that overall odds of winning are approximately one in 3.73 i mean it isn't as kind of lucky as the five pound ones but they are more lucky than the one and the two pound ones in case any of you were kind of wondering now what do you need to do is to scratch off all of the coating from your symbol section to reveal 18 to reveal 18 your symbol scratch only the symbols in line 1 to 16 while wow, this sounds complicated with your numbers test revealed. Okay, right, let's see how this goes then. Right, we need to scratch off our numbers first. Right, let's start at the bottom. winter wonderland ones we didn't actually win anything so i mean hopefully or probably the person before or the person after would have won on that one so that brings us down to the last few of these ones so we are going to move back to the merry million ones which is the five pound ones now we have actually got two of these left so i mean let's see how this actually turns out <laughs> We did actually win a £10, we won £5, or two £5 lines, so we get a £10 in total. So that does actually take up to £48 that we're going to be getting back from all of that. So yeah, that is a pretty good going, I feel like. But we have actually got two more left, and these were, I don't know why, I just decided to keep these on until the end, because I think they are just my favourite ones to scratch for some unknown reason. They just look like an absolute Christmas calendar, really, don't they? I mean, I suppose that is kind of like the idea of it, because it, they are called Christmas advent calendars. But yeah, let's scratch these two off and see what the final result is, really. anything from that one so we've got one more to go now so hopefully this is a pretty lucky one <laughs> 
Now on the last two scratch cards, we didn't actually end up winning anything either. So I mean, that does actually mean that from all the scratch cards that we have actually scratched off today, we have got £48 coming back if my uh, maths is correct. I mean, I'm sure I'll like re-add it up as I'm like editing this video. But I mean, I'm sure that's right. I mean, hopefully it is. I mean, so we did actually win quite a bit if I'm honest with you. To be fair, these ones, we got six of these and we did actually win on three of them. Whereas these ones, we did actually get six and we only won on two. So I mean, it does just go to show that like, you can't really like guarantee that you are gonna win as much as it kind of says, because it's not literally, although it says like it's one in three or one in four or whatever it says, it's not like one in every, that's so many, if that kind of makes sense. But yeah, I just think this is kind of like a really kind of interesting thing to do. And you know what, I did actually have a lot of fun scratching this stuff. Like my hand does actually hurt quite a bit now though from like scratching them off, which I made a first world of problems and all that. But yeah, do be sure to let me know down in the comment section of what you actually thought of this video, if you liked it. And obviously, like I said at the beginning of this video, do be sure to just kind of like not go overly mad on scratch cards because I mean like I said you can obviously end up losing or you can end up like winning some money back because I mean as this video probably kind of shows like this isn't kind of like a way to make money if anything you end up losing money from doing scratch cards because I mean I've literally spent over £100 on all of these and I've got £48 going back which you know what isn't as kind of bad as I thought it was going to be to be honest with you I thought it was going to be a lot worse than that just because I feel like I don't know maybe I'm just quite naive and I thought that it was just going to literally get like 20 quid back or something like that but I mean I have actually got 48 pounds which I'm really happy with I don't really know if that's like a thing to kind of I don't know be happy about with but I mean as some of these you can actually win up to a million pounds obviously I didn't because I mean got my 48 quid which I'm actually quite happy about but yeah so that is basically what today's video was guys I mean do be sure to let me know in the comment section like I said what you actually thought of today's video if it's got you in the Christmas mood if you're feeling any more festive or anything like that I am literally sitting here with my Christmas jumper on as I am actually filming this and yeah at least I've still got my lucky 50p although I'm not entirely sure how lucky this 50p actually is but yeah that is basically me scratching off over £100 worth of scratch cards guys I mean I really do hope you enjoyed watching do be sure to let me know what your favourite kind of scratch card was that I scratched off or if you've got a different one that aren't kind of round this way where I kind of am. I mean, maybe there's some other ones out there that I just kind of like missed and just didn't manage to get my hands on. But I mean, I did, like I said, I did go into a few different stores and just grab a few little different selections from in each kind of place. But yeah, that kind of like rounds off today's video really, guys. So yeah, do be sure to let me know what you thought of today's video and let me know if you're feeling Christmassy or not. Because I mean, I can definitely do way more kind of Christmassy content on this channel. Because like I said at the beginning, I am one massive Christmas fan. And if you can hear anything in the background squeaking, that is basically my pop just playing with her toy wherever she kind of is I feel like she's like in the other room so I'm always squeaking it because I mean I can hear her. I'm not entirely sure if you can but yeah that basically rounds off today's video really guys so, I mean I really do hope you enjoyed watching if you did then please be sure to give this video a massive thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below if you haven't already and do be sure to turn on the post notification bell button to be the first to be notified as to whenever I upload next and I mean there's definitely going to be way more Christmas content coming to my channel really really soon so definitely stick around to see what is coming up next for all of you guys but yeah, that is basically all for this week, guys. Until next time, see ya!